Yo, what's up y'all? Thanks for tuning in. Um, so today I'm gonna actually do a reel review. Um, so this reel is actually one that I was kind of skeptical about. Um, I didn't know if I wanted to buy it, but it was from a company that I love. I think they have the best reels. Um, I know there's a lot of reel companies out there and you might have your favorite, but my personal favorite is Abu Garcia. Um, now I used their reels all through college when I was fishing in tournaments and FLW and Bassmaster and all that. So um, they're not the only reels that I've ever used, obviously, but they're my favorite. I can depend on them. Um, but they also came out with a new um, Revo X. Um, now it's like their budget line of reels. Um, they're only a hundred bucks, so that's a great bargain if it'll last um, and if it'll have the quality of their other reels like I usually use the Revo SX but today I'm gonna take a look at this guy whoa, whoa. yeah I'm gonna take a look at this guy really nice looking reel we'll dive into a little bit of the details and why I like it and why I was skeptical about it um, to begin with all right let's get into it the basic stuff comes in here um, we want, there was one little surprise that I was kind of happy about was this the real oil you always can use some of that um, I always have these and then I lose them and never know what happened to them so I'm glad I have this you can use it for all my other reels too you just get this phone to protect it um, get your warranty little pamphlet um, this one's your parts then this thing I have no clue what it is it just tells you about your warranty just got your specs right here so this one um, obviously is the Revo X. Um, what I got was the 6 6 to 1 so all that means for people that don't know is you turn the reel one time and spin 6.6 .6 times that's all that means I fish left-handed even though I'm right-handed um, just feels more natural and comfortable to me I know a lot of people always mess with me about that but hey if I catch fish it doesn't matter right well as far as the uh, mono line that picks up with that is 27 inches max drag is 18 pounds I know on the Revo SX is 24 um, so that is a difference um, one of the main differences I saw with that um, between those two reels it says it's supposed to fit 145 um, yards of mono at 12 pound I put 17 like I told you I put 17 pound line on this 150 yards so the whole thing fit on it completely fine went fishing no backlashes for over spooling none of that um, brake capacity 30 pound at 140 so uh, this thing actually fits a little bit more than that but I guess if you spool it perfectly right then I guess this is correct but I spool a little bit more and just put the whole thing on there so get back to the reel alright so here's the reel first things first if you take a look at this little matte black finish I think it looks really good so it's a really nice looking reel um, one thing I was worried about is if it would be as smooth as their other reels because it was only a hundred dollar reel and after about two weeks of using it just about every day after work going to ponds just kinda casting around yes I'm that guy that does it sometimes just cast around the backyard or something like that yes I do that but I just wanted to get a feel of the rod um, caught a couple small fish on it then I caught a four pounder and it handled it with ease it was a lot smoother than I thought it was gonna be I know when you buy a high-end rod I'm um, sorry high-end reel you know that it's gonna be super smooth but when you get to the budget ones they're kinda gritty and not as smooth but yeah this thing is buttery very surprised by that but I was really happy about it too only time will tell if it'll last as long as my Revo SX's have I still have a couple on my rods over there for anybody getting into fishing beginners um, not even just beginners but if you're fishing in high school college um, even your pro if you're on a budget and you want to get some reels that are high quality and you know that Abu Garcia will take care of you if anything ever did happen with them while fishing I know that for a fact just in case anybody is wondering um, 
I'm 100% not sponsored by Abu Garcia. I wish. So yeah, I love this thing. So far, it's been the best bang for my buck when it comes to reels. It's super light. It looks good. That's a, that's a big thing for me. So, um, and it has the Abu Garcia name, which is known for quality. Um, if you guys have any questions about this thing, let me know. Um, just in case you're wondering, I had this on a McCain um, fishing rod. Um, it's their kayak series, and this one's the um, Texas style warming, 6'8", medium heavy. It's a little bit shorter, just for when you're in a kayak. Just in case you were wondering. But yeah, um, if you guys have any questions, let me know. Make sure to like and subscribe, and thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.